guys, I'm Karina and welcome to my channel. So I've had short hair for the past six months and I actually cut my own hair. So if you've not watched that video, I'm going to link it right here so you can take a look at that later. But I have been loving short hair and I've been trying different hairstyles for the past six months. So my hair dries off straight. It's not that wavy or curly and I would have to touch up the ends a little bit with a straightener. But it's pretty much straight so I do try to do different hairstyles where I don't need to use any products or hot tools. So today's video will be just about that. I'm going to show you six different hairstyles that I've been rocking for the past six months and I am in love with them because they're super easy, super quick, no hot tools needed, no products, nothing and it's amazing because it actually makes my hair look different every single day. So I'm going to share those six hairstyles with you but before we go into the video, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and I would love for you to be a part of my YouTube family since now we're a family of 20,000 people and I, I just still can't believe that. But yeah, without further ado, let's get started. You'll take a small section of your hair from the top and remove a few hair strands in the front and then just divide the remainder in three equal parts. Take the strand on the right and put it under the one in the middle and do the same on the left side as well. As you keep adding more hair to the braid, make sure you follow the same process and keep pulling the braid very tight so that you can get a clean look. Once again, just keep adding more hair from each side and push it under the one in the middle. You can remove a few hair strands from the front and you can also lift the ones in the back to make it look very even. And that's it, you're done with your first hairstyle. Start off by dividing your hair in a zigzag pattern just like this. Now take a section from the left side and make a very simple three-stranded braid. Now make another braid on the right side as well. You can leave your hair as it is, this looks super cute as well. Or you can also go ahead and secure these braids to the back of your head. For that, all you'll have to do is just take the two braids to the back and secure it with some pins. Now remove the rubber band and you're good to go. This hairstyle is super quick and extremely stylish. Pull all your hair back into a very high ponytail and secure it with a rubber band. I'm sure a lot of hair strands would have fallen out of the ponytail, especially if your hair is super short. All you'll have to do is pull it back up and secure it with some bobby pins. Now take a cute little headband or a head wrap and wrap it around the ponytail. And that's it! I absolutely love how this looks. Make a section from ear to ear and secure the rest of your hair at the back of your head. Pull the headband over your head and bring it up just like this. This is my favorite way of wearing a headband but if you want all your hair pulled back, all you have to do is pull the headband over your head and bring it up just like this and you're good to go. Hey. 
Start off by making a very deep side parting and secure the rest of your hair at the back of your head. In order to make the fishtail braid, take some hair from the parting and divide it into three different sections. Take the section on your right and bring it under the middle one and then take the section on your left and bring it again under the middle one. As you keep taking more hair from the hairline, keep repeating the same process till you reach your ears. Now that you can't grab any more hair from the hairline, keep continuing the braid till you reach the end of your hair. Now lift a section of your hair just like this and secure the braid with a bobby pin. And that's it, we're done with this hairstyle. I saved the best for last and this is my favorite hairstyle. I've been doing this since I was in high school. All you have to do is take some hair from your hairline and twist it at the back of your head. Now push your hair upwards till you get the desired height and secure it with some bobby pins. You can also add a tiny little bow at the back of your head and you're good to go. That's it for my hairstyles video for you today. I hope you enjoyed watching it and I really hope that you're inspired and want to try one of these hairstyles super soon. And I also have another video coming up very soon where I'm going to show you a bunch of different hairstyles for short and curly hair. So make sure to hit the bell icon so you can get a notification when I upload that video. Until then, take care of yourself, stay safe and you'll see me very soon. Bye!